Kevin Lear Bass's video from uh, determining the closest Super Bowl games. That was a really good video to watch. It's about five and a half minutes. And I think it's great because it does not get into you know Excel detail, but I like how he thinks through the problem of how do you determine close game. So um, that's my news. I, I really like that video because um, I deal with I'm gonna stop sharing. I deal with a lot of situations where the wrong analyst is in charge, and you really don't need a whole lot of complex Excel, but you do need people who know how to think, and that's a good demonstration of how to think. And um, what other news is there that? Um, all right, so. I uh, made my final edits on Guerrilla Data Analysis version 2, um, turned it back over to Bill for his final, you know, magic, and then uh, I'll go to the printer in March to be released in April. And I'm starting to write a new book, Full Contact Data Management. That's uh, cool. scheduled to be available in October. Because, and I'm going to focus on data cleansing, exposing crap data, and showing this skill as the sport that it is. So you've got to see how to uh, package a helmet with the book so that people are ready. And, of course, uh, Jordan... Rick and I will be speaking at the BAC, the Business uh, Analytics Conference in April. And then, um, yeah, I'll be uh, telling a story at Mr. Reed Box in February next month here in Portland. So that's the news that I have to share. Cool. And Sylvia, what's going on with you? Yeah, well, uh 2015 is off to a great start. A uh, good year for training. I've got um, a couple private webinars coming up in February for large audiences, which is a little bit, which is going to be interesting, you know, because wrangling 20 people when they all have questions. So that'll be that'll be um, a balancing act, but I'm looking forward to that experience. Um, also, uh, coming up in, um, as you all know. Bill Jellin is writing a book uh, that will be released in September called Excel 40. I believe that's the, the title of the book. And uh, yours truly has entered into a little partnership with Bill to provide a book, uh, a bonus book, that will be a part of that release. Um, mm -hmm. And the working title of that book is The Excel Lover's Guide to Drinking. And I don't mean tea or tap water. Definitely. So we are um, we are in the process of inventing some Excel inspired cocktails. If you have an idea for an Excel inspired cocktail, there is still time um, to submit your ideas to me, and you never know they could end up in the book. Uh, I've got a deadline of April first to get that information to Bill with the layout and the photos of all the drinks. But these are real drinks. You can make them at home. The recipe book will be there as part of the XL40 book in full Technicolor. It's um, it's very exciting. So uh, my first book will be a coffee table book of sorts, but you know, for people who like to to get drunk, not get drunk. No, just a little. That's undignified. Tipsy. Getting drunk is undignified. Bill <laughs> gave us alcohol to enjoy it. So indeed. So that's what's happening. I'm excited about it. All right, Zach and Kevin. I don't know that we came up with anything, did we? Not really. Yeah. Well, tell us about your company. Oh, yeah. Sure, you can go ahead. Uh, yeah, so uh, our, our company name is Data Automation Professionals. Uh, website, which is under construction at the moment, Data Automation Professionals, or dataautomationpros.com. Uh Kind of a, a a new new partnership, but uh, yeah, no, it'll be a fun adventure. Do all kinds of cool automation with automation server and automating data. You got cool. data, we'll automate it. 
But I really like the points that you guys made because I, I wanted to mention Bill's book uh, because I think that's a really cool thing. Uh, he got a lot of um, cool people supporting that. And uh, we bought in. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're definitely supportive of that too. And yep. uh, I, I really like the point that you brought up, Oz, uh, with the, the data. That's always one of the hardest things to explain to people is how to structure good data too. So Yeah. That's More right. power to you, brother. Uh, yeah. tell, you, tell you, you know, tables. I tell you what, you know, I have this with me. This is one of the books that got in my car when I left Chicago. <laughs> yeah, Excel books that are still back in Chicago for one day when I send for them. But this is one of about four that got in the car with me. So there was room because tables, you put stuff in tables, that's, that's the first thing you do. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Great stuff. So what's going on with us at Excel TV? So let's take a look. We've done a few things. Um, Yep. We actually have a site that we've overhauled. Now we have Excel.tv. You see that we we are doing a new design on the site. There's going to be changes as time goes on, but take a look, check it out. Remember, we are at Excel.tv. Um, I don't have it up here, but we also have our LinkedIn group, which now has 200 members. So make sure you come and be the 201st member. Come and join us. Now there's one other thing that we have going on. Um, well, we don't have it going on, but that I wanted to mention, our friend uh, Petros, friend of the show, is, has an Indiegogo project. Um, he says, help me make VBA a more secure programming language, so make sure to check that out on Indiegogo.com, and we'll have a link um, for that uh, later this week. So, 